you get used to it. The great thing about Lutheran High is that the freshmen and seniors are like best friends. I mean, we get along so well. Oh, hey, how's your first day going? I'm in your class, jerk. Oh, oh, <laughs> yeah, me and Bethany have this thing where we pretend to hate each other. It's pretty funny. Uh, we both get good laughs from it. Yeah, I hate her. Well, I find that students really are pretty attentive in class. Too loud. Um, well, Ben always says these hashtag things. Hashtag done with class. Hashtag call me maybe. Hashtag scholarships are a joke. It's kind of annoying, it's just unnecessary. Hashtag, hey Natalie. Hashtag, iPhone. And obsessive. Hashtag, Wall Street. Hashtag, stop it. Hashtag, see you later. And excessive, and another if word I can think of. Yeah. Hashtag, I am being interviewed in the office. Um, I really like to play on my ukulele for the people. Uh, everybody really loves it. Kind of brings us together, you know? Well, honestly, um, the most more annoying part of Lutheran High is Bethany and her freaking ukulele playing. It's right by my locker and it's really annoying. The dress code here sucks eggs. Pretty exciting. What are you wearing? Um, just a sweatshirt. Are those pants? Um, yeah. I knew there were pants. Yeah, the play is definitely my favorite part of the year. Mm -hmm. So, Mr. Pratt, yeah. about this whole play practice thing, right. um, I got the practice schedule and right. I can't make Monday, Wednesday, probably Tuesday too. And Thursday, and yeah, not Friday either. I'm, I'm really dedicated to. I, I just love it so much. It's so much fun. Right. Um, do you do you want a part in the show? Oh, oh yeah, definitely. Because you have to kind of like you know show up to rehearsal. If you want to be in the show. Seriously? Well, yeah, that's that's kind of the idea, right? Do I have to? Yeah, you have to. That's otherwise you're not in the show. Um, right? Well, just save me a part, and I'll come next week. Right. Um, yeah. Okay. That sounds good. And, yeah, I don't think they could do it without me, either. I'm really good. Um, yeah, I don't wanna, I don't want to brag or anything, but I'm really good at basketball. Um, people call me a magic fighter. It's not really, it's not a big deal, but Madison did call me before Sam. Um, but I think they were a little intimidated because, uh, they didn't want a girl on the boys' team. There was that factor. Um, Sam and I play together sometimes on the courts. Uh, my style is a little different than his, um, and I don't want to like make a big deal about this or anything. But he has said that I'm better than him, and I'm not. I don't want this to like go all over the air, but it's just a fact. Like, okay, so he uses one hand, right, to dribble. I use two, better leverage. Not a big deal. Also, um, I I don't really play with fouls. Usually, I don't even play on a court. It's more like, 
street b-ball on the interstate. Um, whoever survives wins. Hey Sam, good job at the game! I know, pretty much the best you'll ever find. Kind of like God, but uh, no one's ever going to stop me. He's just tall. So yeah, I, uh, I hurt my back a lot. Yeah, I twisted it in half, and uh, my left, my left, uh, my left side was all just shattered from from my from my my rib cage down, and I hurt my wrist. But I got a I got a concussion in my head and in my neck, and and I got a I got a really bad foot cramp. That was probably the worst of all, you know, going through the going through the school year without a without a good left foot. You know, it's hard to dance, but uh, that cramp was bad. That was about all. I, that's about all I got. Oh, my wrist! I didn't even touch you. Oh. I didn't even touch you, dude. Come on. Oh. different time. The thing is that it really is like a big family. And I don't mean like one of those stupid cookie cutter families you see on the cover of Parenting Today. The crazy obnoxious families that appear in every single rom-com holiday special on television. I mean a real family. Because let's face it, real families can be messed up. Sure they love each other and whatever, but Sometimes drama, narcissism, and annoying habits get in the way of all of that. So, why do families stay together? They're forced to, I guess. I mean, they all have to live with each other. But, I don't think that's it. I think it's something bigger. Something that unifies us. And in this case, I guess, it's our faith. Some might be upset that religion is brought into this whole thing. You know, you go out into the world and nobody wants to hear about that. But, um, it's true. That's the truth. We love each other because Christ loved us first. So, graduates of Lutheran High, I leave you with this very special message. Love each other like family because in Christ, that's what we are. Family. This is what they want me to read at graduation. Lame, right? I've got soul, but I'm not a soldier. 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 I've got soul, but I'm not a soldier.